On these hoes ain't got no chill. You know we gon' keep it real. On these hoes. What's up, y'all? This is Kamira. <laughs> <laughs> and this is Precious. Welcome to another episode of On These Hoes. <laughs> On These Hoes. Yes, we are back and better than ever. We are feeling good, looking good, about to share. And these hoes celebrating. Yes. These hoes celebrating. Pop, 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 Woo! I think both of these hoes are celebrating new hair hooties. No! Hey! Hey! New hair hooties. New hair hooties. <laughs> well, actually, Camaro's is new, mind the shoes. <laughs> <laughs> but we still out here for the 2020. For the 192020. On these hoes. On these hoes. Yes, we got our producer in the building. Cynthia Yes, running we shit love around you. here. Love you, too. We appreciate you. She's the best producer ever. On these hoes. On these hoes. Niggas is mad that they don't have her. <laughs> <laughs> we don't oh, even loan her out. We be like, no. <laughs> oh, no, no. Oh, wait, wait. Can we have to have a discussion? Yeah. She be like, oh, I got this job. Job. No, 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 Where? no. <laughs> Where? I mean, we want you to do other yeah, stuff. What about but... us? Like, no. <laughs> these hoes need you. Yes. These hoes need you. Okay. okay. Precious, right. what are we celebrating today? Uh, we are celebrating, baby, because you know there are miracles and blessings, miracles and blessings. Mm -hmm. So, you know how, um, certain people don't even be playing about them bills. You know what right, I'm saying? Right, Like that phone. You know, <laughs> they like, you better pay that bitch. Cause that I bitch. paid my shit a week and a half late. Ooh. And I didn't get cut off. <laughs> Hey. Oh, these hoes. <laughs> That's good. good. It is. Because sometimes you can't call out. You like, can't. They, they <laughs> yeah. want to embarrass you. Yeah. They'll let people call you. Yeah. But if you try to dial a number, they be like, bitch, you know. Yeah, you, you get no, no love. Bill. You yeah. get no love. <laughs> And I don't be having no good reason. I'm just like, I'm sick of me, fool. Like, for real. I just be bullshitting with everything. But I was like, you know what, whatever. Shit, if it go, oh, oh, shit, I won't be bothered. I was thinking about what you said before. But yeah, yeah, there was like, I'm waiting till I get home. Because, you know what I'm saying? It be, you know, I don't want to be stressed about nothing. You know, I be thinking, like, this is so serious. Like, if I know where I'm going, sometimes I do, I just leave my shit. Yeah. Because I'm sick of this shit. <laughs> But we celebrating. Yeah, we, we celebrating because you know they don't pay, they don't play. They, they don't. don't. They don't. People are stringing like them bills is like your parents. Like what? You better do that shit. I whoop your ass. Yeah, I stomp your ass out. If you <laughs> got a plan, the plans won't try to embarrass you. But if you on Metro mm -hmm. and you don't pay your bill mm -hmm. or something like that, they really mm -hmm. do cut you off. They will. They, they, they petty as fuck. They'll cut you off. They will. They will. So it's a blessing. Like and yep. like the electricity people and the gas people, they'll cut you off too. They will. Yeah. And the fucked up thing about them cutting you off is it don't it's, it don't come back on instantly. Somebody got to come out. Yeah, you so got yeah, yeah, reactivation yeah. free. Yeah, you might not take a shower shit. for two days fucking with that. And say, you should not cover that shit. But I like one time in college, I did. I was like, what's the fuck going on in here? That's I didn't pay my shit. I'm going to be honest about it. I didn't pay my shit. I'm going to go out here and cut my shit off. <laughs> for real. And then, you know, as soon as I get it. <laughs> I'm just gonna flip the switch. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Why can't we be, res be responsible people for our shit? Got other humans doing this. It's just a trip shit. how they 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 did everything. Niggas used to could start a little fire, <laughs> <laughs> but now they didn't ran these gas lines. <laughs> we gotta pay for it. like. Well, I could start a fire, sir. I can well, set it off in this bitch. Gas? Shit. Why do I need this shit? Yeah. We could cook over a fire. We could get warm by the fire. And that's how we're supposed <laughs> to be living in real life. It baffles me that we are so conformed to like, uh-oh, got to pay my bill. They right. send us a tree, a piece of paper with some shit on it. And then here we go. All you need is a fireplace and a grill. I'm telling you. And don't pay no bills. I got one of them. Fireplace and a grill. Yeah. A grill take charcoal. Fireplace. You. Extra blankets upstairs. And you can make some shit happen. This is crazy. This living. This is crazy. Especially the prices we pay. Yeah. The prices we pay. Electricity is high. Cause I mean, even rent is crazy. Cause you know, at a point in time, nobody was paying rent. It was just like I'm on this land, and you gotta fight me to get me off it. Right. Mm -hmm. this now land, yeah. it's illegal. Cause they got a piece of paper saying this. You didn't make this earth. You didn't yeah, make this earth. Right. We can stay anywhere on this fucking earth. That's why birds shit anywhere. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like oh <laughs> on oh niggas. God. Ain't nary a squirrel. Them squirrels stay in the in the in tree the in my backyard, paying me no fucking yep. rent. Yeah. <laughs> they paying me no rent, and they got no. their whole house up there. They and really some do. They do. They really they do. do. My daddy shoot them out with BB gun. With a BB <laughs> gun. Squirrel? 
Say, but ooh, when I went home, we was really using the BB gun and showing the kids, you know what I'm saying? Oh How to God. aim and shoot the BB gun. It was so fun. It's like so a family. Squirrels, it's not really that. <laughs> it sounds harsh, but it's not. It's a lot of them. It ain't going to kill a BB gun. ain't going to kill nothing. She, you can shoot somebody with one. Nigga, it ain't going to kill you. No, but. <laughs> I it's thing. I never got hit, but you know what? Her paintballs hurt. Woo. You yes. never went paintball? Uh -oh. Oh. Paintball. I heard, but I heard, I've seen the bruises on people. I was about to scrap at the paintball. Yes. I hit me with another. Yes. I'm coming out my paintball no. chick. Where did you get hit at? <laughs> Any, everywhere. You everywhere. know I'm slow. They were fucking me up. <laughs> I was like, hit me again. Hit me again. I'm not everybody and they target. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, this shit hurt. I got bruises. I'm a girl. A big girl. But stop I'm hitting me with it. Yeah. It was a lie. That it hurt. Shit it. hurt. It hurt. Every single time it hit you, it hurt. It hurt. And when somebody hits you in a place where you know like your neck, or your leg, it's like, dog, I'm gonna wait till we're done. I'm gonna fight you. And they like, love doing that shit. They be all crawling on the bah, ground, bah, bah. hiding behind shit, fucking you up. I'm like, I thought this was a game. Nigga, they've been <laughs> practicing this shit since yeah. they were five. The motherfuckers got me in World War II. <laughs> <laughs> The they fuck? wish these was real guns. Yeah. Bah, bah, bah. <laughs> but like how I'm you dead. Like painting is normally so fun and peaceful. You paint. Right. How you take paint and make it a weapon? They made it forceful, honey. They help shoot out. It's Stop. No, I'll never go paint. I felt like the nigga that took me just wanted to fuck you shoot up. Shoot me. Yes. What did you do to him? Nothing. Yeah. I was just but, no. <laughs> was like, yeah. He was, he was trying to get back at you. Yeah, it's like this sure. is going to be fucked up. Mm -hmm. like, it's a game. No, you hate me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, y'all ready for quotes on the net? The first quote is, IDK who needs to hear this, throw that half an onion away in the butter compartment. You ain't using it. Facts. <laughs> in the butter compartment, though? Nah, it's just in the bottom of the refrigerator. <laughs> and, and I don't know, you're supposed to wrap it, too. That's why you really can't use it if it's not wrapped in the up. Still, in, the, yeah. in, the side of the, in the in the clear pipe, in the clear yeah. sticky. I hate when people do that. I uh, know, but I, onion make everything better, though. It do. That shit make everything better. I don't care if you don't know how to do nothing else. If you don't use nothing, put some onion in your shit. Like, saute it raw, whatever you want to do with it. Like, onion is the most flavorful shit. It makes shit so yeah, good. it do. <laughs> it make everything good but your breath, but it's yeah, good, Yeah, true, though. true. It's good. It's true. Good. It fuck your breath up. <laughs> But do y'all get vegetables and onions and just leave them in the refrigerator and forget about them? Like, you swear you're going to eat healthy that week and then... But I don't just leave them in there. It's like, I really, like, go get the shit. I make a salad at least once. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. So you use part of the shit. Use the cucumbers, use the carrots, use the tomato. But then you ain't using the whole shit. You know, I've learned, like, you know... To get a smaller amount? Well, what I was going to... Yeah, because basically... You bitch, you go, cook like it's a family no, reunion anytime. No, no, she no. a goddamn lie. <laughs> no, this I'm bitch gonna... lying. I've learned... <laughs> when you learn? No. Cause she what lying. I was gonna say was that I'm learning to not go big grocery shopping. I don't do that no more. Like buy a whole bunch of shit. Like I'll buy a whole bunch of ju juice and shit, and then whatever I'm gonna use that night, I'll go get from the grocery store because I want it fresh. Yeah. You leave that shit in your refrigerator, you it's already it. old in the yeah. grocery store. Mm -hmm. yeah. Then you get it, you leave it in there. You're not thinking like this shit hella old. So, and then sometimes you don't cook, and then yeah. you just leave it in there. So now I'll be like, okay, if I'm gonna cook, I'm gonna go get my meat. It's easier. It's already thawed out. I just go get it. I go get the salad and shit, and it's fresher. You know Camara is like the candy lady house, nigga. Like, niggas keg it. Nigga, like, shit. That bitch cook. Yeah. They like, they know you got something. <laughs> this bitch got some stuff, man. Pepper. And I keep learning how to greens. make shit, too. Yeah, then she be, uh, nigga. <laughs> I'm not complaining. I'm just saying, she's like, I've learned. No, I know, I know. I'm making all kind of new stuff now. I love making shit. Like, I'm Aww. learning how to make quiche. And... <laughs> She looks so happy too, yeah, don't she? Yeah. And I don't know. I'm just like that. Like, I don't know. That shit fun when yeah. you know how to cook. It's I want to like... start making cakes from scratch. Like on some yeah. ghetto, you know. Not no, from ghetto, me. but like on some, you know, grandma mm -hmm. shit. But even though I'm not a grandma, but I just want to learn cooking. You will be, girl. <laughs> and shit like that. Like, One I don't know. I just want to fuck these niggas and give them a cookie and they be like, damn. Yeah, bitch, this is like that bitch. <laughs> I ain't never had a cookie, nigga. Like, that bitch fucked me good. They didn't make me some cookies. No. Nigga, it wasn't a sandwich. It was cookies. <laughs> Tea cakes. No, but I'm like, <laughs> I, I, I will feed you. Mm, I will. She will. On these hoes. On these hoes. And Precious looks small. She could eat. Oh, boy. Precious can eat. I'm I love, mean, Because I don't fuck with bitches that can't eat. Precious can eat, okay? I can hang with the yes. best of them. <laughs> Yeah. Ah, so no, she but for eat. real, I do eat big boy plates. Yeah. <laughs> so, but, but that's why I love her food. I'm saying I'm not complaining, but this bitch will cook like on a normal day. Like what we having? Uh, beans with a meat in them, greens, macaroni, motherfucking nigga. Like, just for them. Just like, for them. say. Just for them. All right, y'all ready for the next quote? Mm -hmm. 
cool. Can't even tell a nigga thanks. His next sentence will be, so where are you from? Yeah, they do be thirsty <sighs> like that. Or you can't ask a nigga for a small favor. I hate that. Like, hey, can you come hang my TV on the wall? Yeah, I mean, uh, you gonna let me see some? I gotta show you a titty for the hang the TV. I was gonna pay you. I was gonna pay you. Why do you always want a titty or something? I was gonna. I want a homeboy so yeah, bad. Yeah, do like, you know how to do anything? Like, change the oil, mount a TV, yeah. do something. Can you just be our friends and stop doing that, guys? Like, do they still exist? No, they always want to do something. What you gonna do for me? Like, nigga, nothing. Even the ones I got at the crib, they got like kids and shit. Now. I mean, we don't get to kick it, so it ain't like I ain't around them to like be like, hey, come through for me. You know, this shit ain't shit, boy. You right. Nigga, I always want to, yeah. Can, can Just let it be that. Yeah, just let us like yeah, the comment. If we yeah. put a thanks or a little hug, then just take that like, damn, that's pretty thought. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's mm -hmm. all right. The fuck, you didn't have to say nothing. Sometimes I pick certain ones to just say something too, and then nothing else. Like, okay. Yeah, in the DMs too, because yeah. niggas will write a whole paragraph about how they love your comedy and stuff, and then when you say, "Oh, thanks for supporting me," they be like, "Yeah, I, I like you too, though." Like, the <laughs> now you mad for saying thanks? Like, now I just started a conversation with a random nigga. I, My thing is I'm just, just trying say, to say thanks. Let me see when I pull it down what you want. Like, let me just see. You got some money, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Don't give me a paragraph of compliments and anything, the end, but I really been going through it lately. And then I came in, so I just wonder whatever you could do. Now, nah, just say it at the beginning. <laughs> can you help a bitch? No, shout, and shout out to fans can that send money, because I got that recently. Yep, cash This dude out. was like, yeah, he for cash being out. Funny. Yeah, for being funny. And uh, I didn't even tell him a joke. You must have seen him some old shit. <laughs> yes, no, for real. He Shout just out to that. He sent me a grip of bread. Like, it was like at least $200. Say, for real. I ain't going to tell y'all how good I did that time. I did uh, Tahir Zooming with the homies. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They put your cash app up there. And I'm talking about, and you just chilling, talking. And like these people are like, for being funny, for on these hoes, because we love you, because whatever. Like, I, I was like, I never felt so loved. Like, like I might start stripping. <laughs> oh, my God. Am I in church? I'm getting chill bombs. This is amazing. Wow. Nah, but you know Look what we do. Look at us getting money in our cash app with our clothes on. With our clothes hey, on. Hey, you our bitches clothes. could never. You could <laughs> never. You could <laughs> never. <laughs> on these hoes. On these hoes. <laughs> on these hoes. <laughs> okay. The next quote, when your mom gives you a pre-ripped half piece of double mint gum and it tastes like perfume and purse dirt. Yeah, I eat it in a way. Yeah, it does, though. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes I have them in there because I, I, a whole piece is kind of too much, so I, I get half, so I might have a random half somewhere to be in there with some yeah, pennies and some shit. <laughs> I don't get some shit like that. That's me. her. Fuck your mom. That's who. That's, oh, my, it's me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I do have it in there like that. But I'm grateful. <laughs> Uh, my, my breath would have smelled like weed. I needed it. I'm dead. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm, I'm dead. I'm dead. You said, you said I'm dead. <laughs> That's hilarious. No, but for real, my bad. I apologize. I don't be trying to. I keep some shit in there, but I just, I don't know. That shit just be happening. <laughs> yeah. just you all, be everybody got an old piece of something. Of gum. Yeah. You ever just in dire need of something and you just going digging through some shit, you can't find nothing. You might find nothing. Most terrible shit ever, but you like it'll work today. <laughs> oh, hair products! Like if you run out, you will fuck around, put some lotion in. Water your hair and Vaseline. <laughs> yeah, Vaseline. Your shit be. I don't know something. It's basically conditioner, like. <laughs> <laughs> shit heavy than a hoe. Yeah, way down. But yeah. Yeah. That's okay, you shit. ready for the next one? Let's go. When you get drunk with your lady, that shit either finna go real good or real bad. Fucking on Yeah, that's facts. It depends on the mood. But you hopefully, if we get to piss me off, yeah, if we get drunk together, hopefully it's some good shit. Cause you know, you enjoy them good times. It ain't nothing like some good drunk moments. You know, good drunk times. I am that bitch though that'll be that'll you know, set it out. He say something be like that ain't what happened. Like, you know, I am. I'll do that. Or you are why? So, Cause I'm drunk too, <laughs> and I'm in my feelings. Don't be only if like we out somewhere and you start feeling like you know motherfucker doing some disrespectful shit. But you drunk, so you might be overreacting. So when did you have like a a drunk like episode where you was like, damn, I probably overreacted because I was drinking and I probably wouldn't have cussed them out or gone that far. Shit, I've done that a lot. Man, it's just a plethora. Let me see. I've been on my way. Me and my dude been on a, on his on our way to his house, and I flipped out in the car on some drunk shit and got out and started walking. 
knowing I don't walk nowhere. I was I, I was trying to figure out how the fuck where I was. <laughs> And I was walking. He was begging me to get back in the car. And I was like, no, fuck you. Roll, roll, roll. Like, like, no. And then when he finally rolled, I was like, oh, oh my God. Like, I just knew he wasn't going to roll. I'm like, oh, my God. God I'm going to roll. From the house. Why I get out the car? But I'm, I, I'm notorious for that. Like, what happened, had, though? Did you stay dedicated to the walk or did you call an Uber or no, whatever? I had to stay dedicated to the walk because my phone died. No. But, but let me tell you how God will save you. Somebody you know rolled my up. My auntie <laughs> was rolling down the street. I don't know where she came from, like about 10 minutes later. And she was like, I thought that looked like you. I was sweating. I was like, I'm so happy to see you. I was like, Jesus is real. <laughs> I swear I don't even get alone with my auntie. I jumped in that car, hugged her, and kissed her. Like I'm dead. It I'm was dead. like, God, it's crazy. an angel. It's a, it, was, it couldn't have been nothing but the ancestors. And y'all know look, I never nigga. keep my phone charged. My phone had died. It yeah. was dead. Like I don't know what my problem was. You been doing a lot better lately. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because come uh, here, you to be like, bitch. I walked far. <laughs> For like she probably minutes. walked a, one street a block. No, I jumped out on like Exposition, <laughs> and I think I got to Vernon, and bitch. then I seen her. That's far. What time was it? It was nighttime. This bitch. Where the crackheads was. Just out of I'm like Exposition. Right. If I was selling Vernon, drugs, I like, would have came up because <laughs> nigga, I'm sitting there like nigga, I used to stay right there on Simple Run. Right. Yeah, like no. I know that. Like, it was somebody you know too. Jump right out the car, bitch. Yeah. Were you drunk at this time? Yeah, or? yeah just, you know, that's the thing. We and his phone rang. And I was just making sure that you were, because oh, yeah, I'm like. Up. No, I was drunk. I was drunk. I would have never jumped out that car. At but night, where had y'all been? Did I go to the club and y'all ain't left the club? Or what no, happened? we had just went to go get something to eat, because you know it'd be fooled <laughs> by USC. Because <laughs> <laughs> we was drunk. <laughs> no, started out so happy. Food, y'all was on the front. We went to the club. <laughs> Fuck you, man. <laughs> Oh, no, I swear. And that quick. Phone rang. I seen who it was. We got to fight in the car. And then mm. I jumped out. I who was him. it? It was a bitch that you told him not to talk to no more? Mm-hmm. Mm. A bitch that we fought over the last time. I was like, you like to fight over this bitch, huh? Yeah. Boom. <laughs> yeah, you want to go ahead to me. Oh, Boom. <laughs> we do not condone Hilarious. domestic violence. Hilarious. Um, any kind on this show. <laughs> on these hoes. No, the terrible thing, <laughs> the terrible thing about a drunk argument is there's really no conclusion because you're not thinking rational and you don't know what point you're trying to get to. You're just trying to get all these feelings that you probably have let build up over Ooh, time. Yeah, and they might be true, but they are coming out. Yeah. They come out like and fuck your life, nigga, when you're drunk. And you might be high. You can think about you. Go, you slow enough. You are slowed down just enough to be able to comprehend what you're thinking. To manipulate it to sound pretty acceptable, but when you drunk, just like volcano, bloop. Yeah. That's a fact. Yeah. I had nice. I didn't remember. <laughs> I mean, I, I did, lost the earring. I did a real not one. do that. A screw back. <laughs> I lost a real earring. Where the fuck? Oh yeah. See you. And that's you. And see, Kayla did that. <laughs> Pissed me off. A I, I didn't even buy the earring, and I was mad. How? But also, you lost diamonds. What the fuck yeah. was you doing? <laughs> Who loses diamonds? I was like, you drinking Hennessy? No. <laughs> oh, that's what we own? Oh, that's how you feel? You <laughs> Shout out to you, KK Henny. KK Henny. That's my baby. That's my baby. Yeah, I love KK. Shit, though. I'm very proud. <laughs> okay, y'all ready for the next quote? Yes. He's just a friend. Okay, then text him, let's fuck, and see what he says. Oh, you smart, Ooh. sir. <laughs> you, woo. I'd have been texting y'all like I got a quick one. <laughs> I would be like, I will text him there. It's no problem for me to text him there. Now, what his response will be <laughs> is, is not. You can't hang me. out with that nigga because he tried to fuck it. No, 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 but no. he's never tried to. You just put it in that. Now he wants to fuck. I was me. gonna say, e- e- <laughs> if a man is a man, whether he's your friend or not, if you send him this, he gonna be like, sure. Shit, yeah. what? Come yeah. on. Even if he is just your friend. Remember what? Come on. Remember what Melrose did. <laughs> We not, <laughs> our friend daddy, you know what I'm saying? You know, he had passed. And you know, we come we all comedians and he a comedian too. So. And we were sad. Shout, we shout knew out he to was him. sad. And it then was Precious a, was like, You want some pussy? <laughs> I don't know how to fix it. <laughs> what else can you say to someone who dad passed away? <laughs> you want some pussy? And they did cheer him up. Yeah, he, he laughed. That shit was hilarious. Yeah. 
You know what I'm saying? Shit. I, I am the most awkward when shit happening. Like, yeah. I know people always like, especially the family, when me, I'm like the cheer upper. So it's like, when bad, when shit like that happen, I don't have the words. Like, I really, and I, and everything I say is stupid when something happens. Yeah. Like, how you feeling? It <laughs> is awkward uh, to comfort people yeah, in certain times. You, you, of, you like, okay? Despair. No, yeah. dumb bitch. Yeah. They're not okay. Yeah. They lost somebody very close. Yeah. So I just be trying to think of dumb shit. <laughs> yeah, no, no, facts. But that did make him feel better. He was like... <laughs> <laughs> like you know actually, what? Yeah, yeah. yeah, that might be really yeah. cheering nigga up. <laughs> oh, like, oh my god, we gotta find a joke. Like yeah. you know how, um, <laughs> yeah, you know how she just be crazy, you know. And my mama was like so scared, like she just like paranoid and shit. And I'm like, mama. You supposed to be the most Christian one out of all the damn family. <laughs> Where is your faith? You know what I'm saying? Like, ain't nobody else, you know. I mean, we you care, but you know, like you nobody really give a damn. I'm like, oh mama, get up with a little bit, pay attention to shit. Like, yeah. where your faith at, little mama? That's true. You know. But well, I know she was like, shut up. <laughs> yeah, she, she did. I can fly out. You pray so much, <laughs> Corona should skip over this house. <laughs> Everything should skip over this house. <laughs> the way you stay in prayer, I'm like, no. You know. That's but... funny. Y'all ready for the next one? Mm-hmm. We ready. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Fuck that nigga. He a hoe. He for the street, so let him go. Pick another. There's plenty mo. Plenty was... mo hoes is for the street. So which one we picking next? You know was, what I'm saying? That was classic poetry right there. <laughs> but, I mean, it was a good. Yeah, that yeah. jingle was. Hey, 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 you might hey, do it hey, again. Hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, by the hey, toe and hey, if he holler, hey, hey, let him We need to see this to our Eeny, little girl. Eeny, miny, oh, mo. Fuck, fuck that nigga. He a hoe. Oh, he for the street, so oh, let him go. Hey. Pick another plenty mo. Hey, period. 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 Why you doing? <laughs> Period. <laughs> you gotta, Period. Uh, oh my god. Jeez. Nah, but it, the dating is really getting any mini money mo ish for me. Like we could all put a foot in for real. That's how. That's where it's really came from. At this point, it. they all starting to blend. Like I think whatever. We just shouldn't even take it seriously. Like when I go out on dates, I don't expect shit. But the date. Like I'm like, do you lying? I, <laughs> I just order extra chips. <laughs> It's hard for me to even do that. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck? That's all I expect because uh, it's hard for me to even do no, that. I used she to be that girl to be like, oh my god, I, ooh, I really like him. Yeah. I hope no, I don't do none of that no more. It's just a date, bitch. That's it all is. it is. I don't. If he call, he call. If he don't. And I just want it to be fun. I just want it to be natural and cool. I don't yeah. want this to feel like an interview and pressure. Yeah. And we talking about politics and we talking about Jewy shooting the shit and talking about like, a, like I just want to have fun, fool. Like I don't know is it? I can't describe it, but I know it when I feel it. You yeah, know what I'm I saying? Know what you're saying. When I'm around it and it's just fun, it's just cool. But that other shit be feeling like oh my work. God. Oh my god. Yeah. No matter what, no yeah. matter what you got, no matter what yeah. it is, it's just like oh my god, help me get through this. Just get me out of here. Help. Yeah, it is No, no call 911. Let me see who gonna call. NAACP. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Reverend <laughs> Alton. What if there was a help date line? You would call and be like, I'm on this whack ass date. Date, please. Call in a fire alarm to the yeah. restaurant. Somebody <laughs> could just pull up and just say, it's an emergency at your house. I gotta go. I would do that for y'all though. If y'all call me, I would be like, ooh, girl, I've been looking for you. Woo, woo, we gotta own these hoes emergency. <laughs> I'd be like, what? On these hoes? Oh my God. Okay, say, I'll, just, I'll get back to you when I can. Oh these hoes need me. Yeah, these, these hoes need, need me. me. To the back cave. To the back cave. <laughs> I'm telling you. Nigga. Oh my God. Okay. Um, <laughs> was any mini miny moish for me? Is it's just like, all y'all gonna stress me out. Mm. All y'all got the same shit to offer. Dick and stress. That's it. That's why I when just, people be coming down on the city girls, I feel them. They just be like, Cash at me. They just us. <laughs> they like they are the rapper. Cash up. at me. I'm sick of this shit. She's we, like, fuck a movie. Save me to the jeweler, ho. We the comedian <laughs> city girls. Let me know this shit is real. We are the comedy Let city me. girls. Third note. Hey, hey, broke hey. no dessert no. Hey, broke no hey. dessert no. Hey. Playing with you is like playing hey. with my. Hey. Hey. hey, no. Put it in their face. We ain't doing this shit for you. That's how you get the real ones or the play ones. For real. Be like, I ain't playing, bitch. I, you know, you're like, what's playing. up? What's up? You want to I don't wear a jobs, bitch. I am a yes. job. Yeah. Hey. Shit. I feel Better like. stay in line for what? Right. We ain't got time. They, JT ain't got time for this bullshit. What? She fresh out. <laughs> she fresh out on these hoes. <laughs> shit to do. Period. <laughs> Send me a cash out. No, 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 no,
Jeez. Don't have time. What's up, y'all? I'm not gonna lie. It's no telling what I'm listening to. But these days, it really goes on my mood. So I've been feeling real good. So I've been jamming future. But you don't like that old future. Mm -mm, incredible. Mm -mm, incredible. But anyway, you know the best way to listen is with a pair of premium wireless earbuds especially if you can get them for less than half the price than the other guys. That's why I recommend the wireless earbuds by Raycon. Yes, I'm telling you, I've had mine for a while now and I can vouch for them. And y'all know if I said it, then I meant it and what, you know, these are what that is. Yes, I block out all negativity, everything around me. You know what I'm saying? When I'm listening to these, I am listening, I am keyed in. Because these new everyday E25, oh, they have they have everything going with them. Baby, you get six hours of play time, more bass, easy pairing, you know what I'm saying? And a noise isolated fit on these of. Now, the company was co-founded by Ray J, and celebrities like Snoop Dogg, Mike Tyson, and J.R. Smith love their earbuds, too. So, you need to jump on the train, because if you sleep, you need to wake up, because we out here for the 2020. Right now, I'm going to hook y'all up, because if I got it, I want you to have it, too. Yes, go to buyraycon.com slash ODH to get 15% off your first order. Yes, that's B U Y. R A Y C O N dot com slash O D H to get fifteen percent off your first order. Time for underdog of the week. Hey. Underdog of the week. Underdog of the week. That's how you know our shit is flowing. Right. Yes, like and this is when we give props <laughs> to the underdog because, you know, so many times in life, you know, people just focus on the people that they think, you know, in their eyes are the winners and this and that. But we like to give a little light to the underdogs, you know, mm -hmm. the ones who will have little issues, the ones who ain't, may not be quite on top on top. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? I think everybody has been an underdog in their life, too. Yeah. So, shout out to, you know. For real. And something. And yeah. something. And it's always, that's a good position to be in, too. You know? I'm being honest with you. Because they underestimate you. Exactly. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, who's the underdog of the week? Let us know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Y'all want me to set it up? <laughs> Go ahead. Okay. So, the underdog of the week this week is men who fight for their position in your life. They know that there's other men who like you that you may or may not be talking to, but they not pressing you. They not checking you. Yeah. Yeah. They just going to play it right when they with you. Yep. Stick it out until they become numero uno. So and that's a real one to me. Underdog, you are the best underdog for us because <laughs> this is what women do all they life. Right. Them women hold on to they love. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Them women, boy, they like, because I know one day he going to come and be mine. But see, for a man yeah. to be like, okay, I understand. I'm going to wait for Like, to be yeah. like, come here, I know what you do. Yeah. I know you're beautiful. I know you find all all these dudes on you. But what I'm gonna do is when you around me, I'm gonna play my position. I'm gonna take care. I'm gonna make sure you are right, and I'm gonna make sure I win out of all these niggas. That's game. That's game. What would you say to that? Like, how you? What you? You can't. What can you say? <clears throat> okay. Because you can't even <laughs> say what that, what that. He done told you what yeah, he, yeah. nigga. This is. You can't say nothing. Shut me up then. Yeah. <laughs> and let you really come through on that. Right. Let come through. Right. But men don't ever want to play their position. They don't ever want to sit there and fight for their spot on your roster. No, they're like, if I fucked you, then I just need to be the only person fucking you, period. Because you might now. Yes. And, ooh, and let them find out as other people. So do you like them or me? I mean, they will press you. They, they will. will press you. <coughs> you After they act like they don't like getting pressed, they will press you when they want you. Yep. They Especially. will show up unannounced, too. Yep. Fuck? And over little shit, too. Because you know how men have their preference, too, or how they like your shit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, you know. Yes. Some people like your shit a little hair. Some people like yeah. your shit out of the way, Bob. Some people like yeah, a little yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. so, you know, one dude know when I be fucking with somebody else. Hilarious. Do you do it just to fuck with him? Like, I'm, I'm not fucking with nobody. I'm going to shade this shit off. I have think before. I'm grooming for somebody. I have before. But not Hilarious. like, but they were like, say, man, it's a goddamn time. Because, like, nigga, nigga, you don't just get your preference. You Who you? you? It ain't just all about you and yeah. your preference in right. life. Nah, you was fucking somebody I else. Was yeah. Yeah. Nigga, it's summertime. <laughs> <laughs> Give him three. Give him three. Give him three. <laughs> <laughs> and it's charged. <laughs> Step up. <laughs> Do something. 
But any other encouraging words? Because, you know, they try to make men feel stupid for chasing after women nowadays. But I think. No, you smart. It's a beautiful thing. You smart because there's so many fuck boys, we don't know what to do. So you better step up and show us that you you that real nigga. Show me you want me. Because we finna play all y'all to the left because we don't know what the fuck going on. Show and prove. (laughs) Be a real man. Show some shit. You know what we like. You been watching the show. Right. Send us some shit we like, nigga. Protect us. Provide for us. And see if we want. Motherfucking respond. And watch the show and learn what we like. Right. By the way, right. on these hoes. On, on these hoes. Because okay. if you do that, nothing like a surprise you like. Right. You know? That's true. Because I hate a surprise I don't like. Because that's the worst kind of surprise. Because you be like, damn, I'm surprised and I got to fake like I like you. Yeah. It's I too can't. many emotions. You know I can't. You better just think you better admit. Don't give it to me in person. Because I'm going to be like, what is this? Because I'm shocked and disappointed. Yeah. You know, that's, that's my biggest fear to get proposed to by somebody I don't want to marry. Because I'm so nice, I think I'd be like, yes. Camera. You know I would. And I would call you like I said yes to this. And I would be like, it was in front of everybody. You know what I'm going to do? I'm like, bitch, I'm finna call him and say no. What's the number? I am so scared of that. Like, I swear. I swear. She I am is- nice like that. Wow. Like, oh, a ring and everything. Like a whole little. And I'd be like, no. I could not you do that You can't say shit. it like that, but you could be like, now you know. I couldn't even be like. I'm going to crack a joke. Not today. I'm going to be like, oh. you. What would you say if you wanted to say no? How would you say it? I'm like, boy. <laughs> 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 For real, I'm going to look good like, boy. In front of now you know that. In you, front of everybody. I'm be like, y'all, he playing. <laughs> he playing. He know damn well we not get. Boy. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see what that ring look like. Boy, you know damn well. <laughs> now you know. Did we ain't even pre discuss that. I would have to get the fuck up if like, she did that. I would leave. I'm like, boy, he is playing, y'all. They'd be like, no, they flew in from. Who flew in? I'd be like, hey, your mama right there? Nothing. Your mom right there? Huh? Your mom right there? Well, I'm like, mama, you oh. know all the shit this nigga done done. <laughs> he think he gonna marry me. I wanted to last. Like, nigga. nigga. Mama would have been there. She didn't know. Mama would have told her. She, no, if mama knew, mama would have told her. <laughs> Precious, she the homie. Yeah. Precious, he gonna marry you. Yeah. yeah you he flying us out. Mama, you lying. No, I ain't lying. I saw the ring. You're not gonna, gonna, gonna like it. On the plane. <laughs> <laughs> that is so funny. Oh. I'm like, I'm too over this shit. Nigga. I get married. It got to really last forever. Now you, if you bullshit. That's crazy you would say, yeah, Camira. I like, swear wow. I would. Maybe that's and just a And being a birth- fucked up ass marriage too. Probably. <sighs> just, Y'all just- don't listen to She just playing. <laughs> Change that plan. Don't I nobody mean, come up. Before the marriage happened, it might come out. Yeah. But mm-hmm. to just diss him in front right of a whole spot. restaurant right. and shit like that, you I don't think do I it. could do it. You, I just don't think you? I could say no. I'll probably be like in the car, like, you know what? I really am not ready. I just, you know. Yeah, maybe you could say that in there. Later. But say that right there. Like, say, let's just give it some time. I feel like there's been conversations about it or something. But I feel yeah. like at some point, you like, you know, you know. But sometimes niggas would just surprise. Sometimes niggas like you so much, you won't even know. Mm. Oh, now that because you know what I'm saying. That would, now that would kind of fuck no, because like, I know it's a couple of niggas right now that if I entertain them, that's why I don't. I know six weeks later they yeah. pop the question. Oh, yeah, I, I fucking know it. I know who you talking about too. <laughs> like yeah, I fucking know yeah. it in front of all y'all. Yeah, it's like not to the like, world. Oh okay. yeah, they <laughs> like, will. I she, I saw it. Like, like I fucking know it. So no, I don't play them games. Mm-mm. That's but you, true. Yeah. But you would say yeah if they just if they popped up right here right now. Oh, we finished this shit and this motherfucker walk in like Camaro. Camara White, I just been holding this on my heart. And so when it's just us sitting there, we got our producer and it, we got our camera. It's not going to be just us because I'm going to definitely be filming either way. And oh, my we're God. We're going to get the moment. God. You know me. You know me. I'm going to whip the camera out. I'm like, well, either way, we're going to no, get I it. I couldn't embarrass nobody like that after they Come here. So knees. you would sit here and say, if somebody, if he walked, you know who I'm thinking about, too. I know. I know. If he walked his ass in here right now, look at how he look. <laughs> Would you be, would sit here and say, yes. Well, be, with him, I could be like, but we, we don't even date. <laughs> <laughs> but if we were, that's why I won't date him. That's what I'm saying. Like, But but I don't know. But I think he'll still do it. I swear I, know, I think one day he'll still so be like, you, for real, fuck this shit. I really love you. I've been loving you for a long time. Marry and, and, me. And like, therein lies the issue with me and Camille. Kamira can be so savage. She was, I mean, the shit that just rolled off her tongue can be so savage. But then when it comes to these fucking dudes, <laughs> <laughs> let me break it down, tell the sermon. Where's the break, organ? Break Is it an organ? <laughs> shit, I need an organ. 
Is it an organ? Or Insert when organ it, music. Yes. When it come to the dude, Camira, this girl just let all the... I'm like, bitch, we rough and tough with the Afro pubs. What's up? <laughs> and she like, no. I'm just... That's why I like, I swear, bitch, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck what you do. Girl, how in love you is. We got shit to do Look, and I we're going to do it. I'm out Precious is not going to let me get I, married. <laughs> I told this she bitch. She told me no. <laughs> you can give her a ring if you want to, nigga. It's going to be a ring on the road. Oh, my You're God. Fuck ring around the road. That ring going to be on the road. Oh we got shit to do, and I'm not going to play with her right now. Our child is grown. <laughs> Light the blunt. Light the blunt. Okay, and- hey. Light the blunt and let's get into Blank oh these hoes. Blank oh these hoes. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. Blank these hoes. Okay. Mm -hmm. She's so serious. Okay, so this is the part um, of the show where you guys fill in the blank for this sentence. Blank D ho. Blank D ho. All right, first one. So the first one is don't call me and ask me blank. To help you move. Oh, that's a good one. Never call me to help you move. And in return, I will never call you because I know that is one task that is like a, an abundance. That's yeah, like yeah. your family, your dick, you know what I'm saying? Or like your super closest friends. Yeah. Like, it is just fucking insulting, you know, to be like, come here. I'm, I done helped a bitch move. I'm not even friends with no more. And I'm still thinking about it to this day. Like, bitch, I helped you move, huh? <laughs> you know what Especially I'm saying? Especially up some stairs. Yes. <laughs> This ain't on the first flow. Right. What the fuck? You better call somebody. Okay. Shit. No, nah, it's not okay, fool. That is like, some people, it just make you feel like people would just ask you any fucking For thing. Anything. That's why you cannot be that nice. That's why I be telling Camille, I love her. I love her heart. <laughs> but at the same time, Cameron, a bitch will walk up to <laughs> Camille and say some shit like, ah, uh, ah, uh, you know what? I forgot my bra. Can I borrow yours? Come here. Oh, baby, here. Because you know what? I got like 30 oh more at home. <laughs> so here you go. Like, bitch, some shit we have to shut down. At what point is it just too much? And sometimes people think I'm a bitch and I'm just like, but it ain't that. It's just that I, I have been that nice person who really don't yeah. say nothing and be thinking it. But I am just don't say nothing and just go. And, and, and it's because I was taught to be like that, like Precious, don't say that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, or don't say everything. Yeah. So then you, you, you tame yourself. But then when you realize in life, life would have been a lot easier if I, said if I was just letting all this shit out. If I told people how I really feel. Yeah. Fuck all that. <laughs> Nigga. Don't call me in there. I'm not playing. And if you do call it ass, they be ready for rejection. Shit. That's true. Okay, but what's yours? <laughs> Don't call me. Don't call me and ask me to babysit. Oh, my ba- my babysitting days are over. If I wanted to babysit, I would have another kid. I am over kids. Huh. I only like my kid. I huh. don't like your kid. If your kid bad is getting a whooping, because mm. <laughs> you told me to babysit. Huh. I go by the rules in my house when I watch people kids. <laughs> it ain't your rules. If your so kid... if I kick your kid like a soccer ball, right? That's my rules. My friend <laughs> talk about um, my baby don't eat milk. She dr- I said she can't stay here. Yeah. She can't stay here. I'm not. You allergic to peanut butter? Yeah. Yeah. I'm there. gonna fuck up and she gonna be in the hospital. I'm gonna need an epipen, bitch. I'm not about to watch your baby. <laughs> It's, it's, no, I need a sturdy yeah. baby. <laughs> Healthy. Ex- st- <laughs> I need a baby who basically watch they sell. Now but when I see exactly. my niece and nephew, they not even into me. They they come get hunting your hug, then they playing their games. Right. They is in their own world. Yeah. And you know what I'm saying? And sometimes it kinda hurt my feelings because they used to be <laughs> on you, but so But what? no, this time we did have fun. We do we do do shit. But it's like, nigga, I'm not finna tend to your baby like it's time for the breast milk. It's, too it's much. time to change the shit. Yes. It's time to no. And people don't raise their kids like you. Some people, some kids be brats. Yeah, they, brats. I'm not they are. She, <laughs> your little bratty ass kid. I don't think I'm finna be all nice. I don't care if your kitty cam on. You gonna see me talking bad to your goddamn kid. <laughs> now little spoiled dead bad ass kid. <laughs> goddamn, cam. get your goddamn shit together, kid. Hey y'all, this episode is sponsored by Bluetooth. Blue Chew brings you the first chewable with the same FDA active ingredients as Viagra and Cialis. 
Bluetooth is prescribed online by physicians, so you don't have to go to the doctor's office or wait in line at a pharmacy. It ships right to your door in a discreet package. Right now, we have got a special deal for our listeners. Visit Bluetooth.com and get your first shipment free when you use our special promo code ODH. Just pay $5 for shipping. Again, that's blue com promo code ODH. And remember, the more you know, the more you grow. When you support our sponsors, you support our podcast. So don't forget to go to blue com and use our promo code ODH for all these hoes. Thank y'all. Y'all ready for the next one? Yes. yes. Okay. Fill in the blank. I regret blank. <sighs> I regret all, a lot of money that I blew. I, I've, uh, I've blown yeah. some money. Yeah. I, I don't regret a lot of shit in my life, but yeah. sometimes I look back and be like, bitch, why did you mm-hmm. spend that money on that? You blew 10000 Like you know, you mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Just mm-hmm. like, stu- it make you mad. Like, I could have did so much yep. with that fucking money. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So mine is, I regret, because I don't regret a lot of shit, but <clears throat> I do regret blowing money sometimes. Yeah. Like, that's mine. Um... I would say, like, you know, even coming out here and starting shit, I would say I regret being so nice to some people. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, because when I first started doing stuff out here, you know, people back home, want to come out here and visit. You know what I'm saying? It was like, yeah, come out, let's chill, whoop de whoop And, you know, just some people, people just not. <laughs> yeah. Shit just don't be turning out. Uh, they got to let. I'm not gonna even go. There. I just regret being so nice sometimes. You know, like, sometimes you have to learn the hard way. You do. You know what I'm saying? And everybody is shit. I ain't fucking for you. I don't mean to go dark, but I'm just saying. <laughs> I regret being nice to a lot of people yeah. in this shit. You yeah. know what I'm saying? For real. I'm glad now that I done found my little tribe and we cool. You know what I'm saying? And everybody good. But I really do regret being so nice, you know, and just... Because, you know, you said what I'm saying? You want to just be out. You want to do shit. Yeah, for sure. You think everybody cool and they just not. They not, yeah. They just not. Yeah. Some so, people learn you to hurt you. So And yes. Yeah. So that's that. why I be selective with what you give them. You know what I'm saying? A lot of times, shit. They think they know. They don't know. In true <laughs> Hollywood. You think you know, but you have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so. Okay, the next one is when I'm drunk, I always what? Oh, when I'm drunk, I always blank. Okay, let me see. I always think bitches is talking about me. That's why I don't drink when I'm out. Because I be like, what you say, bitch? I always think somebody talking about me. I be hearing shit. Oh, like, my you know God. What that said? Like, oh, my God. Ain't nobody talking about you, Karen. Ain't nobody even thinking about oh Don't nobody God. even know you up here. I haven't done this yet. <laughs> But I swear to God, bitches is talking straight to me. Like, no, that bitch is talking about me. She looking over here. Yeah, like, right. I get hella just, yeah. I don't know, turned up when I drink. Like, um, let me say, when I'm drunk, I always sweat. <laughs> I sweat and I throw my weight around. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, <laughs> I'm always, ah! <laughs> like, I throw myself on people like, I don't know why. Don't, I don't. You do, but not like that. You <laughs> talk shit know. when you drunk, though. I do. Oh, yeah. You talk a lot Ooh, of shit. Ooh, you know what? Daddy, That's fucking scratch shit. everything you else. talk shit. When I'm drunk, I always talk shit. Like, even once I remember, I was at home. It was not even me. You know what I'm saying? Because you know me. Like, I talk my shit when I'm on stage, when I hit the stage. But no, you talk when I'm shit. drunk. We was at this bar and this dude was trying to get at her and he would not leave her alone and she just got on him like nigga you think look at your shoes nigga <laughs> we was outside oh, the club really? oh my god you went in on him from the bottom to the top like and I was sitting there like oh shit <laughs> like, but you then, think because I would've... he didn't leave me alone he, yeah right? he didn't do he didn't because I tried to he, be nice. he was like bro look at your come on you think I would fuck with a nigga with shoes on and then look at you 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 just went in on him the poor little. He probably never wore that outfit. <laughs> was he even laughing? Yes. We was all laughing. I'm sitting there like those people around. Oh my uh, God. So uh, and that's not me. That's why I don't do drunk shit. Ass. Because that's really like my personality is more like only if you come for me. Like I don't just walk around like, ah, look at this. 
<laughs> you know, no, like yeah, but you I really chill, but I did. You did. It, it was bad. No, but it was funny though. Yolo. He All right. I need hoes. I need hoes. Y'all ready to drop some gems? We are ready. Okay. Okay. Dropping gems. We dropping gems. Dropping gems. And we dropping gems. <laughs> we letting people know what to do because sometimes it's better to be an outsider. When you're on the inside, it's hard to see outside. Right. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's a mirror tent where you just can't see out there and it's just a reflection of you and what you think in your own mind. <laughs> but when you're on the outside, you can see better and then you can help people progress in life. Definitely. So we always feel good to know that we are progressing people's lives. Yes, we are helping them in their current situation. Yes, and this week's situation is this. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> you want me to read it? Go ahead, boo. My boyfriend wants to be a rapper. Okay, stop. <laughs> You don't even got to tell us no mm. more. All right, let her over. <laughs> even though we got a full page. It's okay. <laughs> and therein lies the motherfucking problem. No, I'm <sighs> just playing. No, no, no. Because everybody has dreams and goals. And, and no, no, no. But Go no. ahead, boo. What's it? My boyfriend wants to be a rapper, and that's cool with me. Hmm, that's okay. big of you. Mm -hmm. I support his dreams, but he always have all these hoes in his videos. I don't like that shit. I understand if he was a lit ass rapper, but he get like 200 views on his video. <laughs> I'm sorry. You're not about to have these bitches all in your face for no damn 200 views oh, a video. Me. I feel you, bitch. <laughs> I, this sound like this, her talking. You are my friend, this sound bitch. like Kamira talking right now. Like I feel like this bitch is like sending me a voice message like bitch. This nigga really think he a bitch. This nigga think he Gucci these man. These bitches <laughs> showed up with G-strings on and everything, bitch. He had one cameraman. Nigga. <laughs> <laughs> what are they paying the hoes? What are they paying the hoes? Okay. okay. I don't know. Maybe I should just accept it or maybe I'm not ready to date somebody who wants to live that life. Will I ever get used to it? Am I tripping? Let me know the real tea. You ain't Ooh. tripping. I feel. I mean, you are I feel never. You. I want every woman out there to know, regardless of the situation, whether your dude want to be a rapper, goddamn it, whether he want to be a goddamn football coach, whether he want to be a barber, whatever you want to be, just know. God damn it. Where was I going? Is the hoes going to be around? Hoes are going to be around. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Now, the thing is, if your intuition is telling you there is more hoes than success, then maybe there should be a few less hoes. Right. Or why, who are these hoes? And why are they so willing to just be in a video that ain't even successful? That's that's the question. We out here doing a bootleg video. Right. Your nigga told me, I'm out here pursuing my career. And you tripping over these hoes. Where did these hoes come from? Right. We are doing some bootleg shit that ain't on no platform but your Instagram. But you got hella hoes in the video. At your peak, you done got 200 views. Right. You being funny, sir. You are. You're being very funny and I'm not laughing. So if you want hoes in your video, just go be with the hoes. You want to go do whole videos and come home to me like, baby, it's taking off. You know what? Let me stop. I'm being judgmental. We need to know how old he is. <laughs> but not only that, if he got all these hoes in the videos and he only got 200 views, he probably can't rap that good. Because niggas are tuned in to see hoes. <laughs> you sure right. <laughs> only niggas sold blank CDs with a whole picture on it. Right. But, uh, <laughs> With a nice they age. would just watch the video just for the whole content. So they not even listening to his raps at this point. Because you know what I'm saying? This shit is trash, apparently. So just say you want to be around hoes. Because if your, your career, you want to be a rapper. So in the meantime, what he doing? Do he make any type of money? Because yeah. if he do, he working a regular job and it's the side hustle, then just go watch the hoes dance on him. And, and stand there and be the yeah. director. And right now, he needs to be manager. worried about getting his music out. Yeah. I mean, videos are important, but... Don't nobody be on them no more. Not if they don't know you. Remember 106? Like, like, we don't, don't even have videos, videos on... Yeah, like, ain't no MTV and shit. Yeah, we ain't no even shit. looking at real people videos. Don't like, nobody so... be at the crib like, turn on them video. Right. That don't... Yeah, sir. We put on the Bluetooth, shit. but not that video. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I'm just keeping it real. It's the yeah, 2020. I feel you. I feel you. At some point, we have to move forward. So any final words for her? What should she do? I think she should have a talk with him and be like, um, you do, you going all about this the wrong way. And I, you know, I don't, I don't like have it. a talk with him. And how about city girl on his ass? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Boss up. Do he got some money? Broke niggas don't deserve no pussy. Oh you know what I'm God, saying? Oh Boss God. up on him. You know what I'm saying? If you want to go be around some dudes and live your life, go be around some high class dudes. Go to a golf course, bitch. Go to a cigar lounge, bitch. Go up your shit. You ain't got to just chill and wait on the rapper. Do you think she should try to be in any of his videos or no? I was going to say, did he ask you? If he right. asked you, like, come be the lead girl. Right. You can have whatever you like. Hey, but if hey, every hey. video have hella hoes in it, what type of music is he making? Like, nice. you know? 
So she just got to decide for herself. If he's making booty bouncing music, then he I might don't know be. How gonna then get he might have to have one. But you know, videos yeah. don't succeed with one. Remember, Charlotte Crunk in the club. It was hey, one bitch hey. mm-hmm. shaking that shit right there by the fire truck, nigga. You don't need a bunch of hoes. You don't. If you got some shit going, you can have one to two and make it do what it do. Yeah. But like one or two good hoes is better than a whole bunch of regular hoes. Right. And if you know you satisfying them, <laughs> if he ran some hoes and coming home, then you fuck it. But yeah. if you know this some bullshit, and I think you do know. Or maybe she should do the casting calls for the hoes and pick the hoes. How about you pick the hoes? On these hoes. On these hoes. Because I think I could respect that better. Like, I think this one and this one. Don't Go ahead, babe. Man, Get bitch. your money. Yeah. Right. If you want to uh, drop a gym, we will help you. It is not a problem at all. Not Just right. send us an email at onthesehoes at gmail.com. What's up, guys? So The Salon with Lala Milan is a new podcast I think you will love. Do you hear me? Now, you might already know Lala from her viral videos on Instagram, TikTok, and her infamous parodies on YouTube. And if you don't, wake your ass up. What you been doing? She everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, hey. Where you been? Are you even online if you don't know her? Anyway, <laughs> if you don't know her, make sure you look her up. Make sure you follow her. Make sure you support the Salon Podcast, okay? Because we already know she's a hilarious influencer. She's a comedian. She's an actress. Not only is she that, but she's also an expert at giving makeup tutorials and fashion advice. And now, her and all her homegirls, you know what I'm saying? It's upsetting me and my homegirls. They will be discussing everything from sex, relationships, politics, everything that's going on in the world. And you know it is a lot going on. So there will be a lot to talk about, which is why you need to tune in uh, on these hoes to me. Hey, and she is black and she is beautiful and she is making major moves and we like to uplift. We don't downplay, we upplay. Okay, okay. So make sure that you tune in to The Salon with La La Milan in Stitcher, Apple, or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to subscribe. Are you guys ready for the dick pic of the week? We are always ready for the dick pic of the week. I just sent it in the group chat from the email. This one was submitted through our email. <clears throat> group chat, okay. okay. He's strong. He's he, strong. His, he legs, his thigh is strong. Yeah, his legs are really strong. And he's strong. showing the length of the dick to the thigh. Right, so he's coming down right above the kneecap. Mm-hmm. However, comma. It's skinny. Yes, so it's, it's kind of skinny. And Number two pencil ass dick. It's not that skinny. Look at that. That's not that Maybe skinny. Let's blow it up. Maybe let's not blow look it at that second one. It That's it, not that skinny. These two pics are the same one, right? Yeah. So look at this one. We'll look up to the other one because maybe it was that. But see, you holding that it back one look good. Okay, I mean, the first like one. Pushing it, making he it is. Pu- he is holding it so tight. Okay. It might bust a vessel. Here's a problem with the skinny ones. They tend to hurt. <laughs> pokey, pokey, Pokemon. This is Pokemon. Like, yeah, you know, like, even though it has a nice... They irritating. It has a nice <laughs> length, but and I'll take the girth any day. Yeah, like, give me yeah. some girth. I need to... Uh, Put some fat it's on it. That, that, it's not that that that. It's not that skinny. No, it's not. It's not a uh, hot dog skinny. It's not. It's not hot dog skinny. But it. But ain't, it ain't link. It, it ain't, ain't no hot link. Though, it, it ain't no hot link. <laughs> on these hoes. It's on these in hoes. the middle. You know what I'm saying? So it's like between a hot dog and a link. So y'all yeah. imagine. But I mean, it comes on up. But it's like between a hot dog and a link. Kielbasa sauce. No, <laughs> but that first one, that vein is popping out like it's yeah, ready to I do some damage. No, so y'all wasn't feeling it. All right. But no, he cool. He cool. Well, you got one. You got one. See, the, see, look at his fingers. See, them a thing. Let's like, see the dick. Yeah. We imagine this. Yeah. Not all the time, but look at that. I mean, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Turn you wouldn't just it down. I'll try it. Right. You know, he not terrible. It's Mr. not terrible. Yeah, it's not horrible. It could be a lot well, we worse. Say, this is Mr. Red Shirt, so you know who Mr. You are, Red because Shirt. They like getting called out. Y'all are some freaks. Right. I just want to let y'all know. Right. <laughs> And please send us the nickname that you want us to yeah, call you. Yeah, let us you. know what you send want us, us to call you. You want us to call you, so we. So you but know you we definitely, about you. he'll get the right one. You get you a nice yeah. little, thing, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Little thing, you're gonna fuck up. You're like, It'd oh be my good god, to ride. Nice. that type is good to ride. Because um, when they're in yeah. control, sometimes the skinny ones be like, "What are you doing?" Mm. <sighs> yeah, it's irritating me. Pokemon, Pokemon. No, for real. Is his his nickname Red Shirt or Pokemon? Because I feel like Pokemon's more catchy at this point. Pokemon. Pokemon. All right, so Pokemon, we're rating him on a scale of one to smash. (laughs) 
I'm going to say on the stupid I'm, I'm, I'm on a five. I'm on a five. Five? I, I say he ain't that bad. I would give him a seven on a drunk night. If I don't want to know you, you're like a five. Oh. <laughs> right. <laughs> well, re, well. So his bye. personality, if he had a bomb-ass personality or if he like. Like if he was swinging around. Like, 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 or if he just. And if he ate coochie good shit. Different things. If something yes. else turned you on. You think it cover it? Yeah. It's like, probably. I mean, we could just suffice, but yeah. not re- Like, sometimes you just like, we ain't got time for nothing else. Give me something right quick. Boom, boom, yeah. boom. Yeah. And so, but listen, Pokemon, five ain't that bad, because we definitely got some ones that we will talk about in later episodes. But we got some ones in the email. But uh, where can people send it if they want us in theirs? <laughs> send it to Oni's House at Gmail. Oni's House at gmail.com. Okay, guys, make sure you like, share, and subscribe, and comment on all our videos, because we love you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yes, and make sure you follow us on Instagram at On These Hoes Podcast. We put a lot of behind the scenes. Yes. We go live. We put clips before the shows, after the shows. We just kick it, okay? We got merchandise, so make sure you support. Get your On These Hoes shirt. Mask and shirts. Yeah, masks. cups. Hey, everything. We popping. Yes, and we appreciate y'all. So make sure you stay tuned too. On these hoes. On these hoes. <laughs> on these hoes. On these hoes. On these hoes. On these hoes. On these hoes.